Hi, my name is Miss Sarah and welcome to Make and Learn with Aurora Public Library. Make and Learn is a series of games and crafts you can do with your child to support their early literacy and cognitive development. We'll show you how to do the craft or activity and then explain how it supports their development. Today's Make and Learn focuses on the early literacy practices of read and play while encouraging the early literacy skills of letter knowledge and print motivation all while making the alphabet fun. This activity was inspired from an activity from the blog, Seven Days of Play. Thank you to Michelle for letting us share this with you today. Be sure to check out Seven Days of Play at the links below for more fun ideas. For this activity, a grown-up should put it together and then kiddos and grown-ups can play with it together. Setup is easy and it includes items you probably already have at home. You'll need a cardboard box, plastic spoons, permanent markers, and an X-Acto knife or scissors. Grown-ups, start by very carefully cutting small slices in the box, just wide enough to fit the handle of a spoon. If you want to use the alphabet, you'll need 26 slices, but you can do numbers too to practice counting. After you have all the slices cut, you'll label the box. I'm doing the alphabet, but you can do numbers too to practice counting. You can use uppercase or lowercase, whichever you would like your child to practice. When you're labeling, write the letters or numbers under each slice. Now you'll need to label your spoons. Again, you can use uppercase or lowercase or both. I've done both, putting a letter on both sides of the spoons. This is a great way to practice recognizing that an uppercase A, for example, and a lowercase A are the same letter. They just look a little different. Once you have your spoons ready, it's time to play. Mix up your spoons and let your little one match them. They can match the letters on the spoons to those on the box, or for older kids, let them practice making words. Ignore the letters on the box and let them spell out words or their name. This activity encourages letter knowledge, which is knowing the alphabet and knowing the sounds each letter makes, as well as print motivation. Turning practicing the alphabet into a fun game like this gets kids excited to learn to read. The action of pushing the spoons into the slots on the box is also helping their fine motor skills. Plus, it's just a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed this fun activity today. Tune in to Make and Learn next time for more fun early literacy activities. In the meantime, visit our Pinterest page pinterest.com slash Aurora Public for more early literacy tips and activities. See you next time.